Oh, this is this is real life shit. Okay. Okay, so we just so the scene begins. We walk into a Taco Bell, and there's two girls ordering at the front desk. And, and we're we're you know I decided to get the new. Uh, it's like a queso no nacho box. It's a grilled stuffed grilled stuffed nacho box. I'm getting that, and Aaron's getting a quesarito. <laughs> so we decided on what we want and then we're like you know getting ready to order and then the people in front of us say you know I'm getting a quesarito too and then we're like well which flavor are you getting and they're like getting oh shredded God. chicken you're getting too detailed <laughs> I gotta I gotta document everything the whole thing yeah the whole thing chicken I'll, make I'll sure cut, we know it's a chicken I'll cut stuff real. out of the scenes later <laughs> so so she's getting shredded of chicken. I'm like, that's a safe choice. Because you never know what's in the beef. And I then, got the beef. <laughs> you, I like but Erin got the beef because she, like she likes the beef. She likes the cat food. <laughs> so, so I was like, I was joking around with her. And then, how did it? Oh, I, I noticed her shirt. And her shirt said, MB Mona Vista Equestrian. <laughs> and I, like horse people. And I was like, you're horse a rich people. bastard. And she's like, she yeah, I am. She's been on a horse. <laughs> it's because she spends her life on a horse because that's how she was born. Like a Christ, She's a Christian horse person left over from the Crusades. By the way, you're already weird when you're Christian, but then when you're a horse, a horse Christian? You got problems, dude. Horse Christian, no bueno. <laughs> <laughs> horse Christians are no good because they have horses on their side. Anyway. So she, she has a shirt on, right? And I was like, you're a rich bastard. And then I said, you know, like my dad drives a bus there. And she's like, I had your dad as a ceramics teacher. You're, you're Gonzalo Rodriguez's son? And I'm like, yes. And then they're like, can we shake your hand? Can we shake your hand? Yeah. So and they both, they both shook my hand. And then one of them... They took a selfie with me in the background, but they didn't tell me about the selfie, so I like photobombed their picture, and I'm probably going to be on their Instagram feeds oh, pretty soon. You're probably going to look all confused. And I'm going to look confused, and like, <laughs> I got Lost. caught red-handed in the middle of a Taco Bell on Friday night at 10 p.m. <laughs> getting a grilled stuffed nacho box, and they took a selfie with me, and then I was like, May Jesus and everything else be with you as she walked out the door. <laughs> yeah, that was that was smooth, baby. <laughs> Real smooth. <laughs> I can't believe you said that. <laughs> I said that and she's like, thanks. <laughs> she meant it too. She likes she likes Jesus. <laughs> she likes Jesus. And <laughs> she's a rich bastard. And she admitted to such <laughs> Okay. Oh. That's that's one of the scenes from Aptos the movie. No makeup. Messy like hair. verbatim. Like no changes whatsoever. Whatever. Whatever. Whatsoever. Oh, and that she ordered a green drink Wait, is that ours? and it was ready early. Okay, that's it. End. Why? Why we're driving home from Taco Bell. Taco Bell. At fucking 10 p.m. Practically. 10 p.m. Oh, we forgot parts of the story. So, so. One of the girls was barefoot, and the other girl was wearing sandals. Really flimsy ones. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna change their names to protect the innocent. By the Do way. Do you even know their names? Uh, because yeah, they know. they mentioned them. They I I got introduced to them, but I'm gonna purposely forget them, <laughs> so I can reinvent their names later. Purposely, <clears throat> purposely to protect the innocent. Right. Um, because you didn't just forget. So them. anyway. One of them was barefoot, and she walked there. No, no, she had a skateboard. She skateboarded there. But then she, the bare feet, like, not to be better, skateboarded there with bare feet. And then she said that her friend took her skateboard. Her friend took her skateboard. And some magical friend who wasn't there took her skateboard. That's crazy. That's that's a crazy part of the story. And she acted like it was all cool, though. <laughs> Like, what was up with that? She must have been high. No, she no, must, she was totally like she, 
she was so. She was on something. 